There's going to be some action right here on the pin. Oh, nearly a collision between Italia and Great Britain there. Josh McKnight, third out. Annalise Murphy just up above him. Richard Mason in there, and it's a general recall. Plenty of boats over. Ah, they've given him another general by the looks of it. Right oh, this is the third attempt at getting one off. We've got a black flag situation, and everybody's behaving themselves. Funnily enough, we've still got a few guys pushing up towards the pin. Guys in the middle are way over. Good luck picking who that is. We're just sitting up here at the committee boat waiting to see who's been a naughty little boy. So all you blokes can go back and have a picnic. And I think we might have a clear one. All right, so here we are at the top mark. So many guys dropping off foils up the top here. So we've got Peter Burling going around the top mark first. Oh, just pulling the tack off. Rob Greenhouse right behind him. Outridge coming over here to the left hand mark. The first win of the day. It's only taken us two hours to get this race, but there it is a very, very quick race. And Peter Burling goes over the line for another win with Nathan Outridge close behind in second. It's the Italian superstar, Francesco Bruni. Simon Hiscox, is he going to make the finish? Yes. Very loose there for Simon, just throws it through. Kohei Kojimoto leading the fleet in. Jason Belbin chasing Joshy. Tommy Burton in there, Luca Demick in there. Tommy Burton, how was that day, Tom? Better than yesterday. Um, yeah, yeah, I just needed to get off the start line, I think. Um, and I managed to do it a bit better than yesterday, not the best for sure, but uh, better than yesterday, so better day. Went out with a small, rushed in after that first race, but there was no wind to change the high lift, then Breeze came in, rushed in again to swap to the small. So yeah, it was uh, something I'm not used to. <laughs> not certainly on a laser, just one of everything, mate. That's just Chuck too it easy. In, sit on the bottom of your boat, you can wait all day, wait for the wind, and then off you go again. Had a little scare on the first run in that last race, you'll probably see here snap the tip off the foil. So we were, uh, we were sailing around with That's probably not fast. a little bit of drag, <laughs> but uh, we hung in there and, uh, and came through good in the end, so pretty pleased with today. Have you changed anything or are you just getting used to the boat a bit more? Uh, just getting used to the boat. Uh, you know, that last race felt like I had really good speed, but just too tired, good to keep hiking. So that was um, yeah, and it's something that hopefully we get a few more races tomorrow. Oh, not great. No, I, um, I led the first one when they abandoned and I was going down the last run, I was in front in that one. and. It's the second race this series that's been abandoned when I've been leading. But, uh, and then, yeah, just lacking a bit of punch compared to the top guys. I think I had a few eights and tens today. So I was sailing okay and um, enjoying it. Warren's there, Warren's got it just in front of AMAC and then Francisco in third out of that group. Bianchi, the Italians, driving, driving. Where has he got his bowing? Oh, we've hit the mark. There's boats going everywhere. Francesco Bruni just misses out on the carnage. All trying to soak in. Simon Iscox pulled him down. Oh, very close race in there. Starboard, starboard, starboard. Oh, nearly collision. Oh, yes. Oh, Santiago Lang, how are you, sir? Very good, and you? Yeah, good, mate. Good. You come down to check it all out? No, just to see friends. <laughs> yeah, just see friends. What do you think of the racing? Uh, it's awesome. This, this is a great class and it's a great sailor, so awesome. The best uh, we ever seen for a long time. When are you getting one? I got one, but uh, you know, no time. No, I, I wish I'd be younger to do that. Why are you here, mate? <laughs> Amax is your age, mate. Get out there and get amongst them. <laughs> no, I have enough with uh, my Nacra and Cecilia. You know, we are trying again, so enough with that. Going again, mate? I'm trying a little bit. A little ah, bit. well done, mate. Good, Good luck to you. Soon. Thank Thanks, you buddy. Much. Thank you. you. Right, as we uh, as we go through the park here, I think we've got currently in third position here. Ian Jensen, how are you, Ian? Not too bad, mate. A bit mate. tired, a bit sore. Long, long day, mate. Long day in the water. Holy cooks. Yeah, I think everyone's saying the same thing. Like, got two odd hours to get that first race off. Yeah. Holy dooly, but uh, conditions certainly kicked in, and they were pretty intense little races as we got going. Yeah. And your scorecard? Uh, good today. Um, Good enough to get you in the third. Yeah, yeah. Uh, <laughs> a couple of top fives and a couple of top tens. Nah, it's, uh, yeah, but the, the intensity of the racing is just insane. So uh, 
I think if you just miss one tack, you can lose like 15 places. It's yeah. so awesome. But There's uh, little lanes everywhere. Yeah, it's pretty shifty. So uh, anyway, mate, it's all on for tomorrow, so good luck.